And the Marshall Plan has been called the greatest example of U.S. public diplomacy done right in history. The more you learn about World War II, the more you realize how incredibly destructive it was beyond a measure that we can even think about now. You have to look at the photographs in order to see the destruction of the roads, the homes, the factories, all of the industries in certain parts of the European countries completely destroyed to the extent that they couldn't even rebuild themselves. As a result, some very wise people in the government, George C. Marshall, the Secretary of State, of course, who had been a general in the war, and uh, the president at the time, Truman, made the decision that in order to rebuild Europe, uh, that that would be in the interest of the United States, not only because Europe it was, has always been an important partner to the United States, but also because this seemed to be a pivot point in history, a time in which if there was no assistance to help rebuild Europe, then, then other systems of government might come in. The whole situation is critical in the extreme. Uh, but there's no doubt whatever in my mind that if we decide to do this thing, we can do it successfully. And there's also no doubt in my mind that the whole world hangs in the balance as to what it is to be in connection with what we are endeavoring to put forward here. Thank you. For that reason, as well as others, the United States dedicated a significant portion of its own federal budget to help rebuild Europe.